Hey, hey, hey guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with Fishing Planet, and we are still with the Halloween 2024 event. We are starting to run out of time on this event, guys. We are getting close to, I believe, what is 11-4 is the last day that we can do this. So, I'm pretty sure we're not going to be able to complete all the event missions. There are just too many of them, but we're going to try to get through at least this one, if nothing else. After that, I'd love to see what happens in the uh, Amazonian maze, but Congo would be great too, but yeah, there's just not enough time, guys. There's too much to do in this one, and some of it has been seriously tough. The Green Skulls Challenge, I believe that was the one that a lot makes you go after the Tembiqui. I did try that. Yeah, there's the Green Skull. What gets me is you have to start this here, but I, I don't think there's any Tambiqui here. If there are, I haven't caught them before, but we're going to try to get over to the spot that I've caught them in the past. I'm hoping that we have enough time because they only give you 25 minutes to get these guys. Now, the last time I came here it was Actually, a sunny day like this is. There's not much of a peak on this day, so... Might not do so well. Same spot as the Trahira spot. I actually have a marker here. A couple of good places I've caught them, and this time I went back to the main menu and picked up another float rod. So that I can put one out while I hold on to one. Now I'm going to use rubber tree seeds. I've got this set at 22 inches. A 4 odd hook. That's what's worked best for me in the past. I only need to hold one rod on there. Wait a minute, let me put that on the first one here. And I'm going to try this spot over here for this one. Caught them in both locations. On this one I've got Wari palm fruit. And the other one I've got river tree seeds. At least we double our chances of getting a bite. Okay, this a little bit bigger. Probably a Brycon. I've been getting Brycon here on this on sunny days, just not the Tambiqui. Okay, we'll try this again. I'm gonna give it one more shot, and if I don't have any luck, I am going to advance time to the next day, to the peak on the next day. Cause... Okay, come on. That could be what we're after here, guys. No. 
Same thing. Red eye piranha. Just not big enough, whatever they are here. Trophy Brycon. Yeah, I th we gotta go quicker than this, guys. Let's see if we can't... Do what we need to do, and that looks like a better peak to me, if you ask me. Sometimes you just gotta do that. If you wanna complete these missions, that's for sure. Okay, this could be it. Yeah, this is it. This is it. Without a doubt. There's our first one. I think we may have one on here too. Let's see. Yes, without a doubt. I don't know what took him so long. Yeah, using two of these rods was definitely ideal for this. Nice one, 27 pounder. And he was further back, so... Actually, I might put a marker on that. Yep, right there. I just went a little bit farther back and had some luck. We gotta get three more, and that's not gonna be easy. This one I got, same old spot. Right on top of that marker. Oh wow, we might actually have one. That's something decent. Could be a good size Trahira too. Yeah, it's a nice Trahira. These are also called wolf fish. There we go. A unique Brycon. That's awesome. We're getting a lot of uniques. Of course, not the ones we need. But I am going to get a picture of him. Sixteen oh eight cash. That's not too bad. Would not have thought that the... Okay, what do we got here? Another Brycon, I think. Yep. Oh, boy, that's bending. That might be... Yep, this is a Tambique. Good. But we're going to cut this close, I'm afraid. Trophy Tambique. Nice. Let's put that one back. Let's put this one just ahead of it. 
Just gotta get two more guys, and we will have this. Alright guys, I was not able to complete that mission the first time around. And I'm going to try this again, but this time I think I am going to try fishing for them here. Because... I was notified before that they have people who caught them here. Next to those set of trees, apparently over the right side of it, so we're going to try it here. I think some people have the idea that if you move around it helps if you got some spots. I haven't caught the Tambiqui in multiple spots though, just at one, so this is going to be all new for me. Well, let me see. Again, we're going to try the Wari palm fruit. To the right, huh? I hope that's too, too far back. And... I'll put this a little bit ahead just to make sure I covered it. And I'm going to try lure fishing for him too, just to make certain. Maybe I didn't get a Tambiqui, but I definitely got something. Let's see what we got here, guys. I think we got us a peacock bass. Nope, and a papa. Oh, wow. Okay. Something. Definitely went for it, and I think it is what we're after. Oh, yeah. Definitely a good sign at 22 minutes of getting a, something that big. This will allow us to mark it, so that's great. Yep, this is definitely Tambiqui or Black Paku. Nice. So I've got an all new spot. Well, like I said, let's mark it. And I've had them go for the rubber tree seeds. I've had them go for this, so... Okay, I didn't really... Oh. Something. Okay, something bit it and then it quit, so... I was trying to get it... Right on the marker. I'm a little bit to the right of it, but... Oh, shoot! Well, this is definitely a better spot, but we've got something on the other one, too. Jeez. Okay, now I see why they gave you a chance to catch five of them. Ah, shoot. Thing is, I might lose the other one. This one's much bigger than the last one I caught. Yep, I lost the other one. We're gonna need a net for this guy, I think. Trophy Tambiqui. Nice.
5764. I doubt we'll get a unique, so I'm going to go ahead and do a shot of this guy. Look how big he is. That's a beefy looking fish. <laughs> okay, we're going to throw that right back out there again. 19 minutes to go. Recast this so they went both of them went for that bait. Well guys, I've been sitting here for quite a while. Got all those bites at once and now nothing. I don't even understand it. It's pretty much exactly where I had them. And they're not even trying. I did put a few bottom rods out here to see if I could catch something else. Alright, come on. Yeah, I've been getting a lot of other things, like right now, looks like it's going to be another Brycon or something. Yeah. But not what we're after. Now I get the third one. Two minutes left to spare and I get the second one. What is going on here? Hmm. It's not going to help me now. Well, guys, we're running out of time again. Three of five. Well, that was better than we did last time. We had two of five. Mission failed. Green Skull count Challenge. Well, the only thing I know to do... Because I was looking at peak periods. And I did notice. You look at the next day. See, we're getting down in the peaks here. The next day, the peak is much, much longer. But I've got at least 17 minutes before I could fast forward through it. I did want to test something before we end this. We may not actually complete a challenge this time. But I'm going to do one more thing before we do quit. And I'm going to check a spot that I was told about for Peacock Bass. I'm going to start the mission. <laughs> And it's way over here, but... Supposedly there's a spot for peacock bass over here. So I think they're trying to make it so that you can get close to good spots. It's just that I'm not aware of these spots in some cases, and some... I mean, yeah, see, here's the... The blue... Is this the red skull? The red skull. Now the Red Skull, 40 minutes, well, 39 minutes, 40 minutes is almost 40 minutes anyway, and that's a lot better, but supposedly it's over here, and 
I placed a marker in it too. It's supposed to be right here. See, it's in it interesting that they put a pumpkin there. Kind of makes you wonder. Well, I'm gonna try it. I'm going to try a few things that I know they go for. I know they go for poppers. I know they go for walkers. And I've got, I think I've put a, at least one walker in here. Yeah, we've got the frog popper, rainbow jumps. We've got the stout walker. Now... Let's see, will that do a stout walker? Yes. Let's try that. Oh yeah, and I wanted to change that leader from a steel leader. I'm afraid that might be spooking them too. But there is a fluorocarbon leader, so that should do it. I was wondering if that might not have been what the problem was before. I don't know. I could be wrong. The Stout Walker is an event lure. Now we're not in a peak, so I'm not expecting amazing things here, but not too bad. At least we're catching fish. I'm not sure if I've ever gotten a unique Jacunda. I don't think so. I've gotten quite a few. What have I not gotten? I've not gotten a unique BR here. Or a unique butterfly peacock. No, I have not gotten a unique Jacunda. Or a unique Oscar. Or Payara. See, I haven't gotten trophy or unique red peacock. They are the toughest. The, the absolute, total, most difficult to get. Yeah, I'm going to try the stout walker a few more times and then I might try the frog pup right through those lilies. Yeah, the walker seems to be catching more than anything else. And it got us a butterfly peacock. Alright, we got something here. Well, oh, son of a gun. There we go, our first one. It's about time. Took forever. <laughs> Let's put a marker on that so they are here. And he was a little further out. He's way out here. They don't seem to be biting off the live baits, though. Now we got another bite. Got to keep the tension on this this time. God bless it. I'm going to losing this one, too. It is another one. I'll be damned. New personal record. Very nice. Well, the walker definitely made the difference here, guys. Heck, I just need one more. If I could get one more, I've got this. And I was sure I'd get the Tembikri one first. Of course, this isn't over yet.
Okay, we got something here. And it seems a little big. Most likely a butterfly. Oh my goodness, I got a unique butterfly, guys. It's the first one for this map. How cool is that? I have been getting my share of uniques lately. And I couldn't get them before, just during this darn event. That checks another one off my list. Well, guys, this is going to be the toughest, like I said, part of this entire thing. I have a feeling that the next one is not even going to be anywhere nearly as tough. If we manage to get this done before this whole thing is ending, I will consider myself lucky. I'm not going to get the others, that's for darn sure. But I'm going to try one more time on this. I'm going to leave this here so I can find the spot. Because they are definitely here. But what I'm going to do, as you notice, the peak is going down. The peacock bass seem to bite best at the peak. So I'm going to try this. This is just a little test. We're going to go over here. We're going to initiate this. See, they only give us actually 39 minutes. That doesn't even make sense. Then we're going to go. Well, I always want to bring that up instead of going to this map. We're going to go back down here. We're going to go over to our spot. I left that there so that I could find it easier. Oh, I picked it up apparently. Well, that's kind of sucks. <laughs> okay, well, I think it was right here. I, mean, I just want to be sure. No, it was definitely not on either side of the tree, so I wanted to be sure I had it exactly where I had it before. All right. Now, I'm going to forward time to this extremely long peak period the very next day. And we're going to see, and I'm not going to do the float fishing or any of that stuff. We're going to focus on the walker. That's what caught us, the darn things. We're going to try this during the peak period. Okay, we got something. Let's see what it is. It is a red peacock bass? Yes. Still, we're at normal size, but at least we got one. Stay focused. Alright, what do we got here, guys? Peacock Pass, maybe? Papa? Trophy of Papa. And we got something else. A 
Another butterfly peacock bass. Okay, I see a flash of red, guys. This could be it. Yes, there's our second one. We have 20 minutes to get one more. If we can do that, we will have completed the Red Skull's mission. I don't know, accomplished something <laughs> for once. <laughs> Starting to feel like f flopping in the mud here, guys. Just flopping in the mud. Alright, guys, we got something... Somewhat significant here. I think it's a butterfly, but I think it's bigger. It's the second one, and it's a personal record. <laughs> second unique butterfly peacock pass. Jesus. Two. We already beat out the last one. Nine point seven eight zero pounds. Still got to get one more red one, guys. Just one more. We have 11 minutes to make that happen. I don't care how big it is. It could be the tiniest one I've ever seen. Alright, I think we might have it, guys. I think we might have the final one. Yes. And it is a trophy. My very first... This is my very first one, guys. Finally. Boy, these things are elusive. Seriously elusive. Trophy peacock. Red Peacock Bass. Unique's the only one left. Red Skull Challenge is finally completed, and that's leaves two left. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. Took a lot to get there, guys. That's all I know. But anyway, as I always say, aim straight, cast far, and have fun. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.